The uh, first umbilical uh, has now separated, standing by for the second umbilical to fall back. That will be the issuance of the launch command sequence. T minus 15 seconds. There goes the uh, second umbilical. Launch command is now issued. Engine start sequence begins. Engine turbo pumps coming up to flight speed. Four, three, two, one. Ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of the ISS Progress 55 resupply ship, beginning a fast track rendezvous to the International Space Station. The blockhouse at Baikonur reports uh, good launch parameters. Roll, pitch, and yaw program is in. All structural parameters reported uh, in good shape, ducking uh, inside a layer of clouds, parking out uh, to the northeast in pursuit of the International Space Station. Coming up on the one minute mark of the flight. All main engine uh, parameters are reported to be normal. One minute, 20 seconds into the flight, about 30 seconds to go before first stage separation. The four strap-on boosters uh, will be commanded uh, to be jettisoned, falling away from the vehicle. All first and second stage thrusters are operating normally. Coming up on the two minute mark, standing by for first stage separation. And booster separation is confirmed. First stage separation is now confirmed. Uh, the Soyuz booster and the Progress resupply craft now 30 miles in altitude, 73 miles downrange from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, traveling at 3,900 miles an hour. Standing by uh, for the uh, shroud jettison. First and second stage thrusters uh, reported uh, operating normally. All good indications so far as the progress heads uphill. Now we have confirmation of launch shroud jettison. This occurring uh, with the Soyuz booster and the progress at 52 miles in altitude, 102 miles downrange, traveling 4,500 miles an hour. The vehicle is stable and reported on track. <laughs> 